Uh, uh. Oh, that poor guy. Do you break anything? The scepter will have my eggs. What the hell? Oh, we're just fucking we're massacring everybody. Okay. Fucking assholes. Oh, that poor guy. I ah, ah, ripped my face off. Dude, these guys are savages. Are you kidding me? Today, how she could forget if she didn't forget. She's with her dancing master. She's with him every morning. With the dancing master. Gosh. Go back to your room. What is it? What's happening? Do as I told you. No, nobody listens in this damn show, and then bad shit happens. They're not gonna kill this sweet old lady. Oh boy. Come with us. Your father wants to see you. My father wouldn't send you. Yeah, with that fucking toaster on your head. Are you men or snakes that you would threaten a child? Get out of my way, little man. Oh. Or bastard. Dude, what? He's doing it with a wooden sword? We are done with dancing for the day. Run to your father. Dude, what? How is the, how is the wooden sword keeping up with this? All right, fucking Ezio, all right. Come with me. Run. The first sword of Bravos does not run. I knew he was gonna say that shit. <laughs> no, man. Go. All right, bro, you're not gonna win this. Just run away. The fuck are you wasting your life for? Not safe. Not safe. Today very much might be your day. Dude, this is fucking crazy town. There she is. What do you want? Want you, wolf girl. Come here. Be, be, be. My father's a lord. He'll reward you. She'll reward me. The queen. Stay away! Oh. Oh, how you like that fucking Pillsbury doughboy looking ass? Fucking dweeb. You must be thirsty. Yeah, give me some fruit punch. The rest of your household, though. All dead. You watch my men being slaughtered and did nothing. I was unarmed, unarmored, and surrounded by Lannister swords. When you look at me, do you see a hero? Yeah. What madness led you to tell the Queen you had learned the truth about Joffrey's birth? The madness of mercy. She might save her children. It wasn't the wine that killed Robert, nor the boar. No shit. The wine slowed him down and the boar ripped him open. But it was your mercy that killed the king. Your wife has let the imp slip through her fingers. If that's true, then slit my throat and be done with it. Not today, my lord. Oh, you prick. Who do you truly serve? Himself. The realm, my lord. Someone must. How did things go to shit so fast for our boy Eddard? We need them to catch wind of what's going on right now. That's the hand the wolf tore off in his sign of Benjen and the rest of his party. It's these two, my lord. Been dead a while, I'd say. The smell. What smell? There is none. If they'd been dead for a long time, wouldn't they be rot? They froze. Mr. Eamon awaits you in his chambers. A raven from King's Landing. Oh, boy. Yeah, we need all these things to converge right now. We need help, dude. The king... Is dead. All right, now tell the rest of the of the story of what's going on right now. Is there any word of my father? Yeah, your father is fucking being held captive in a dungeon from a King Joffrey. Old Stark has been charged with treason. They say he conspired with Robert's brothers to deny the throne to Prince Joffrey. I hope you're not thinking of doing anything stupid. Your duty lies here now. My sisters were in King's Landing too. I'm sure they'll be treated gently. Oh, yeah, I'm sure, dude. Do you realize who's in command now, Prince Joffrey? Sansa Sweetling, you were innocent of any wrong, we know that. Yet you are the daughter of a traitor. How can I allow you to marry my son? Oh. The girl is innocent, your grace. Oh, this slime. You must write to Lady Catelyn and your brother, the eldest. Word of your father's arrest will reach him soon, no doubt. Best it comes from you. If you would help your father, urge your brother to keep the king's peace. Tell him to come to King's Landing and swear his fealty to Joffrey. Oh, my God. If... If I could see my father, talk to him about- You disappoint me, child. I- I've told you of your father's treason. Why would you want to speak to a traitor? Because it's my father. What will happen to him? That depends. On your brother. And on you. She- Oh my god, dude. This is- They are the worst fucking clan of slime balls. You're summoned to King's Landing to swear fealty to the new king. Joffrey puts my father in chains. Now he wants his ass kissed. His grace summons me to King's Landing. I'll go to King's Landing. But not alone. Call the banners. 
Oh. <laughs> yes. I want to defend my father, have they not? They have. Now we see what the words are worth. Yeah. Apparently words ain't worth much in this universe, as I've learned. Dude, if Ed dies, I'm gonna be pissed. You afraid? I must be. Good. Why is that good? It means you're not stupid. The boys. Boys are coming back. We need brand rolling up. Pop, pop, popping fools. My queen, my queen. My husband. You've had this since dawn. He sent it to me. Not you. Does family mean nothing to you? Family means everything to me. And I will not risk Robin's life to get caught up in another of your husband's wars. I'm hungry. Hush, my darling. You just ate. Oh, he wants some more. But I'm hungry. Soon you need soon. to uh, give him a good pop in the chops. Go on, sweet. Time for your bath. I'll feed you after. He's like, I'm looking forward to it. You say they shoved your boy from a window. These people will do anything. And that is why we have to stop them. I know. Like, you think they're just gonna stop? The Knights of the Vale will stay in the Vale where they belong. I'm not your toady, and I'm not your friend. Though I would treasure your friendship, mainly interested in your facility with murder. And if the day ever comes when you're tempted to sell me out, remember this. Whatever their price, I'll beat it. I like living. He might be my favorite character so far. Tyrion. Tyrion. What do we got? Oh, what the hell. Come, share our fire. Help yourselves to our goat. I hate that their horns are upside down. Meet your gods, you tell them, Shaga, son of Dolph of the Stone Crow sent you. I am Tyrion, son of Tywin of Clan Lannister. How would you like to die, Tyrion, son of Tywin? In my own bed, at the age of 80, the belly full of wine and a girl's mouth around my cock. <laughs> <laughs> Take the half man, kill the other one. No. No, 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 no. My house is rich and powerful. If you see us through these mountains, my father will shower you with gold. We have no use for a half man's promises. At least I have the courage to face my enemies. What do the stone crows do? Hide behind rocks, shiver when the knights of the Vale ride by. Those are the best weapons you could steal? Lannister Smith shit better steal. Oh, fuck. Yeah, you gotta like be careful the way you're talking to these people. You win us over with your trinkets. Maybe. Worth a shot. That's a trinket. It's worth more than everything your tribe owns. If you help us, I will not give you trinkets. I'll give you this. Vale of Aaron. Lords of the Vale have always spat upon the hill tribe. Lords of the Vale want me dead. I believe it is time for new Lords of the Vale. He's good. He's, I, I like him. Like, I know he's kind of like on the enemy team, but I, he's fucking cool. The traitor's busted. No! no! Stop putting it out! Careful, dude. You'll hang for this, busted. I, he didn't do what his father did. It. What the hell? Leave Johnny Boy alone. Whatever you do. Ghost? What's wrong? Is someone out there? Oh, they're plotting like a prison shanking. Commander! Who's there? Hello, Commander? Fuck is that? Oh wait, what the fuck? The dead guy? The dead the dead guy. Okay, he's like a zombie now or some shit. Snow! Come on! There's zombies in this show. Oh, what the fuck? Why'd you grab her from that end? There's zombies. I don't know how I feel about that. I thought the Dothraki didn't believe in money. Gold to hire ships, princess. Mm -hmm. Ships to sail to Westeros. The world used to be savage back in the day, because that's it. I mean, you get the wrong fucking tribe rolling through. You are done. This is your fate. Fucking awful. Princess, you have a gentle heart. This is how it's always been. Come. What do you want done with them? Bring her to me and those women there. Is she building like an Amazonian tribe type In thing? Oh, princess. I can. And I will. I am the Dragon Queen. Genia Bella Jalar. Hash Mamora Mamora.
Oh. Keeping us in my usual foyer. A Jacques Riz, my mind. Which Phineas had a hisses, said us. Any near my was so soon, my. Telling her with the fire. Tana Charak Bosale. Mago. Is that such a getcha hile? Oh. Asumaja. Jack Nin. A foreign how? Making a big mistake, buddy. The fuck you think you're getting out of this? I'm not a joke. I do it's your own bassinet. No, Trump, good on. Kid, you know, say. Oh. Oh, oh, he eats that. Now my lungs. <laughs> you step up to Cal Drago in his ponytail. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> He's a savage. Is that his tongue? Fucking uh, f fatality. I mean. Zoshi. Yeah, that's a scratch. Who are you? She's the doctor. My mother was God's wife here before me. She taught me how to make healing smokes and ointments. The great shepherd sent me to earth to heal his... Alright, dog, you don't gotta be rude. His wound must be washed and sewn, or it will fester. Why are they so against women? <laughs> like, what the fuck? What is wrong with these dudes? Bro, you get us some fucking uh, two-in-one conditioner or something, she sure, sure won't be as bad. Since I've been making corpses out of men, boy. I'm the man you want leading the vanguard. No, you're not. I will lead the van, or I will take my men and march them home. We do kind of need them. You are welcome to do so, Lord Umber. And when I am done with the Lannisters, I will march back north and hang you for an Oathbreaker. Oathbreaker, is it? I'll not sit here and swallow insults from a boy so greedy pisses grass. No. Okay, okay. Your meat. He's like, I'll beat it. Is bloody tough. <laughs> <laughs> This guy's fucking two fingers not off in his animal. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are men, dude. That's crazy. Where are you going? South, for father. But it's the middle of the night. The Lannisters have spies everywhere. I don't want them to know we're coming. If you don't hear from me, don't be scared. Till I return. This is a lot of pressure on Rob right now. He's got to step up big time. Big time. How long have you been hiding out there? Long enough. Fucking miss something? Who is that kid? Since fucking when was he a character? What are you doing here? They're my gods too. You guys are really just letting her wander around? Really? Even slaves are allowed to pray. You're not a slave. A friend did put a knife to my throat. But did I? Try telling your brother he's marching the wrong way. All these swords, they should be going north, boy. North, not south. Cold winds are rising. Oh, man. They were touched by white walkers. That's why they came back. That's why their eyes turned blue. It's definitely the most reasonable explanation. How'd you know that? I read about it in a book. The white walkers sleep beneath the ice for thousands of years. And when they wake up, I hope the wall's high enough. How are they getting over this wall, dude? Like fucking harpoon guns? How are they? Do they just climb it like Spider-Man? That's it's a hefty wall. There's enough seasons in the show that potentially Ed and his crew could team up with the Lannisters to fight the bigger baddie. Maybe. Mother. What? You look well. Yeah, I've been eating good. I've no fear, my lady. We'll shove our swords up Tywin Lannister's dung hole. And then it's on to the Red Keep to free Ned. <laughs> I like this guy. Kind of a waste that he lost two fingers for no reason. That could be used in battle. That's crazy. He's like, ah! There was a letter from Sansa. From the Queen, you mean? Yeah. I think you gotta do some diversion shit. There's no mention of Arya. No. No. How many men do you have? 18,000. How many did they have again? If you lose, your father dies. Your sisters die. We die. No pressure or nothing. How many did the Lannisters have for men? I forget. I want to say like, for some reason, 34,000 sticking in my brain. Now they got this crew. Oh, dude, they are the Redcoats big time. All right, then. I'm to meet my father. God, knowing the show, how South 
This could go so fast. Bringing a bunch of barbarians yeah, to the fucking high society crew with our engraved shields. Jamie smashed the river lords of the Golden Tooth and now lay siege to River Run, Catelyn Stark's homeland. Mm. Stark's Lord Eddard is our hostage. How did my sweet sister persuade the king to imprison his dear friend Ned? Robert Baratheon is dead. Joffrey rules in King's Landing. Dude's like, yeah. If it please my lord, Sir Adam bids me report that the Northmen have crossed the neck. Uh-oh. Nothing. Rushes into the lion's jaws. So be it. Kevin, come on the drummer's beat assembly. Really? Like, we're worrying about the drums right now. We're going to war. We could use them. Ride with me against my enemies, and you shall have all my son promised you and more. Only if the half-man fights with us till we hold the steel he pledged us. Little lion's life is ours. Fuck that. You kidding? Dude, this is cr I can't believe we're going to war already. Do we move against Jamie or Lord Tywin? Probably Tywin. Captured a Lannister scout. Where did you find him? The brush above the encampment. He looked to be counting. Yeah, you guys need scouts and shit. You need all the info. Not him, though. He's a snake. How high did you get? 20,000, maybe more. You don't have to do this yourself. Father would understand My if father I... understands mercy. And there is room for it. Let him go. Are you fucking crazy? What is wrong with them? Come on, Ned. Tell Lord Tywin, winter is coming for him. 20,000 northerners marching south to find out if he really does shit gold. Wow, that dude just hit the fucking lottery. I don't agree with that. Are you touched, boy? You call me boy again. Go on. This dude's way bigger than you. Stupid move. Stupid move. Don't give them any information. Once raised to the rank of Lord and granted the eight. I wish I was a Lord. And that his sons and grandsons shall hold this honor after him. King Joffrey. <laughs> this is crazy. How did this happen? Sir Barristan Selmy. Sh what? Shut your face. I have yours to command. Rise, Sir Barristan. May I remove your helmet. You have served the realm long and faithfully, but it is time to put aside your armor and your sword. It is time to rest and look back with pride on your many years of service. Some bullshit. You let my father die. You're too old to protect anybody. This kid can shut your mouth. The council has determined that Sir Jamie Lannister will take your place. Oh, God. If I am a knight, I shall die. A knight. A naked knight, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, everyone here is a piece of dog shit, huh? Here, boy. Melt it down and add it to the others. Fucking pussy bit. Not him. Joffrey. Kinda looks a little goofy walking away with his skirt. Your grace. Oh, careful, careful. Come forward, my lady. <laughs> Come here. Lady Sansa of House Stark. I ask mercy for my father. Treason is a noxious weed. Do you deny your father's crime? No. Ah. The child's faith. Such sweet innocence. Shut up. Treason is treason. <laughs> okay, use a straightener on your bed. If you still have any affection in your heart for me, please do me this kindness, your grace. Dare talk to King Joffrey with my ring. He has to confess and say that I'm the king. There'll be no mercy for him. He will. Yeah, I don't, I don't think so. That's where it ends? Damn, son, I had a little fucking ominous music at the end. Sansa came to court this morning to plead for your life. And her knees begging for me. Do you laugh with the others? You do me wrong, my lord. Your blood is the last thing I want. I don't know what you want. I've given up trying to guess. I know. He was just kind of like lingering around. I was still a boy. Before they cut my balls off with a hot knife, I traveled with a group of... It's gotta be pretty memorable. They taught me that each man has a role to play. The same is true at court. You want me to serve the woman who murdered my king, who butchered my men, who crippled my son? I want you to serve the realm. He's such a weirdo. You think my life is some precious thing to me? I would imagine. I would trade my honor for a few more years of what... Of what? You grew up with actors. I grew up with soldiers. Yeah, my man's got fucking honor for days, dude. See, only a fucking gangster would say that. Are you kidding me? Pity. Yeah, the only pity is your face. What of your daughter's life, my lord? Is that a precious thing to you? And just don't be thinking.
what it, what it seems like. Are we going to war? Sir Robert. Sir Father would do whatever it took to secure our crossing. If I'm going to lead this army, I can't have other men doing my bargaining for me. I'll go. You can't. I have known Lord Walder since I was a girl. He would never harm me. I know. What the hell is it? There was a profit in it. Uh, that is true, I guess. He'd sell you for a KFC meal. It is a great place. Is he? He's from fucking uh, Harry Potter. I think. What am I supposed to do with you? Uh, father, you forget yourself. Lady Stark is... Who asked you? You're not Lord Frey yet. Not until I die. Do I look dead to you? Yeah, pretty much. I need lessons in courtesy from you, bastard. Your mother would still be a milkmaid if I hadn't squirted you into her belly. <laughs> what the fuck? That's a bizarre way to word that. Who is this poor soul next to him? Is there somewhere we can talk? We're talking right now. Out! All of here! The structure of how, like, these places run is always hilarious because they just, they take orders from... I mean, I guess we do that in real life, too. We take orders from fucking bozos. Take orders from absolute fucking clowns. Fifteen, she is. A little flower. The honey is all mine. Ah, oh, you are... You, you gotta put this dude in the dirt. When does Eamon think you'll be able to use that hand? Soon, he says. Good. We ready for this, then? Whoa, what's that? Wolf was more appropriate for you than a bear. Oh, that's sick. This is Valyrian steel. Oh. It's my father's sword. His father before him. I wouldn't be standing here if it wasn't for you and your beast. So you'll take it. I don't think this means I approve of this nonsense with you and Alistair Thorne. I'll apologize to Sir Alistair tonight. No, you won't. Sent him to King's Landing yesterday. The hand that your wolf tore off that thing's wrist ordered Thorne to lay it at the feet of this boy king. It should get young Joffrey's attention. It's a thousand leagues between you and Thorne. I'll go and put your sword somewhere safe. Yeah. All right, yo, you got an in now. This dude's cool. He's like a cool uh, Colonel Sanders. Yeah, he's, uh, he's, he's the man. Wow, we gave him that sword. That's how you know you got the in. The fucking Valerian steel sword. You were not snow. Thank you, bro. I appreciate you. That thing is sick. It was a raven. I read the message to Maester Raymond. Is your brother Rob? What? That he's going to war? He's heading south. To war. Oh, dude, you gotta be front lines with the fucking Valerian. I should be there. Yeah, you absolutely should. I think how long of a journey is it from the wall to where they are? Lord Walder has granted your crossing. And what does he want in return? You will be taking on his son, Oliver, as your personal squire. He expects a knighthood in good time. Fine, fine. Yeah, that's fine. That's light work. And Arya will marry his son, Waldron. When they both come of age. She won't that, be happy about that. All right, well, that's light work. No, no one cares. You worry about that when it happens. And. Oh, no. When the fighting is done, you will marry one of his daughters. Ooh. Whichever you prefer. All right. I see. Bro, you got to do what you got to do. Did you get a look at his daughters? I did. They're, and? They're rough. One was. Was okay. That's all you need. Then I consent. Oh, dude, yeah, that's, yeah, that's the manly man move right there. I mean, he doesn't have to, like, see the wife, right? Like, he can just kind of be married and, you know. At least he's got mad good excuses. He's be like, babe, I'm off, I'm off fucking fighting war, front lines. I may be a bastard, but he is my father and Rob is my brother. The gods were cruel when they saw fit to test my vows. They waited till I was old. And what could I do when the ravens brought the news from the south? Ruin of my house, the death of my family. I was helpless, blind, frail, but... When I heard they had killed my brother's son and his poor son and the children. Who are you? Who are you? My father was Micah. My brother Egan reigned after him when I had refused the throne. And he was followed by his son Aerys. Oh. Whom they called the Mad King. Aemon Targaryen. Wait, what? I will not tell you to stay or go. You must make that choice yourself and live with it for the rest of your days. He's the OG Targaryen? I actually like this storyline a lot. Cal Drago. No, he ain't looking so hot. No, man. This guy, this guy just wants mad conflict. She's gonna be in for a world of hurt if Drago bites the dust, because then they're just gonna overthrow her. They're not 
We're gonna be dealing with that shit. You better not die to some stupid shit like this. When the battle commences, you and your wildlings will be in the vanguard. Me and the tribesmen, on the front lines. They do seem rather ferocious. He's putting you to the test, bro. You better get your shit together. Ron managed to keep Shaga from chopping off the dead man's cock, which was fortunate. But even still, Ulf is demanding blood money, which Shaga and Gunther refuse to pay. Only there are ways to have me killed that would be less detrimental to the war effort. There will be no more discussion on the matter. Why is this guy such a prick? Why are people the way they are? What a pussy. You could tell because he's got the fucking curtain on his shoulder. The odds of me living long enough for him to retaliate have just dropped drastically. We'll be at the vanguard tomorrow. Oh, well. These people really take dying. Very, uh... Well, pour my wine, laugh at my jokes, rub my legs when they are sore after a day's ride. Want you to fuck me like it's my last night in this world, which it may well be. And what do I get? One, safety. More gold than you can spend if you lived a thousand years. Dude. Do you accept my proposal? Yeah, like what's the alternative? You just go around with a bunch of random fucking Lannisters or whatever? Sounds like a deal to me, hombre. <laughs> No, dude. You idiot. Now you see why it's not a good idea to let people just cut you. Khaleesi. Come. Dude, fuck. He will die tonight, Khaleesi. He can't. Nah, he can't, bro. Are you kidding me? We didn't get to see him in battle. We must go quickly. I've heard there's a good port in a shire. I won't leave him. He's already gone, Khaleesi. I know, he's just kind of mumbling right now. Why would I run? I am Khaleesi and my... My son will be Carl after Drogo. Here, the only honest strength will be fighting after Drogo dies. Whoever wins that fight will be the new Carl. Won't want any rivals. Your boy will be plucked from your breast and given to the dogs. Yeah. Oh my God, Khaleesi, you think you're way tougher than you are, girl? Dealing with a tribe of savages. The wound has festered. Yerjin, Zalimikisha, Boss Azizaki, Shafka Akka, Shafka Asjin, my God from Medrivoi, Mevosi. Oh yeah, we're, we're running on fumes here. Vos Zavek and Hakoi Zarvosi. Zarvosi Drivi. Yeah, that is true. What oh, cow, dude? You kidding me? I think you should wear your armor tonight, sir. I think you're right. It's a death sentence if you stay here. He's beyond the healer's skills. All I can do is ease his path. Save him and I will free you, I swear it. You must know a way. Some magic. There is a spell. What? What's the spell? Yeah, he needs all the spell. Ew, he looks like a Muppet like that. This is blood magic. Only death pays for life. So who you gotta kill? My death. What? No, not your death, Khaleesi. The baby? Ooh. Bring me his horse. Oh. Okay. Fuck the horse, dude. Save Cal Drago. Oh, the poor horse. He's like, hey, where are we going, man? He's like, no! Now, how the fuck is killing the horse gonna save Cal Drago from a staff infection? Oh. God. oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I'm sure that'll work. Oh, God. Oh, the poor fucking horse, dude. Are you kidding? Is it actually working? My Nah, dude. Nah, nah, nah. Yeah, come on. She's prego, dude. Don't be doing that. Come on. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, careful, careful, little fucking. The fact that they don't fear death just makes them so no. Yeah, how do you like that one, bud? Rule number one: no one should enter that tent. Here's how it works. I make a statement about your past. If I'm right, you drink. If I'm wrong, I drink. And no lying. Your father beat you. I think that was kind of an easy one to read. Killed your first man before you were 12. It was a woman. Mm. Your turn, my mysterious foreign beauty. Your mother was a whore. <laughs> oh my god, all right. Drink. What a fucking statement. Don't talk about my mother and father ever, or I will carve your eyes from your head. Ooh. Okay. Mysterious foreign lady. Our lord here used to be married. How did you hear that? No, you hear lots of things, playing dice with Lannister soldiers. You used to have a boo thing like that? Night, perhaps. 
Oh, God, come on. She was a wheelwright's orphan, and she was hungry. Together, we finished off three chickens and a flagon of wine. And somehow, I found myself in her bed. It didn't last long. I didn't know what the hell I was doing. But she was good to me. She kissed me afterwards, sang me a song. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Made you feel good. I was deep enough in love to ask for her hand. A few lies, a few gold coins, one drunken septon, and there you have it, man and wife. Fortnight anyway, until the septon sobered up and told my father. First, my father had Jamie tell me the truth. The girl was a whore, you see. Ah, oh, what? No, man. Arranged the whole thing. The road, the rapers, all of it. Really? Thought it was time I had a woman. You do that elaborate fucking plan? My father brought in my wife and gave her to his guards. He paid her well. Silver for each man. How many whores command that kind of price? Brought me into the barracks and made me watch. What the fuck? You should have known she was a whore. <laughs> really? Okay. I was 16, drunk and in love. A girl who's almost doesn't invite another man into her bed two hours later. Bro. You're still young and stupid. Why? Hey, but that, get the hell out of there. You don't want to witness none of that going down. Damn, that's a fucked up story, though. I do like their camp, though. It looks like a renaissance fair. Yeah, he's a, he's a soft dude. He just wants someone to... Sing him a little bedtime story. What is it? What do you want? You're sleeping through the wall. You stole the night's march on us. They're a mile north. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. If I die, weep for me. Yeah. You'll be dead. How will you know? Oh, that's nice of her. Yeah, that's so what I want to hear. Dude, he's got his own fucking armor set and everything. Your dominion over the veil begins now. Claim what is yours. Half man! Half man! Half man! I kind of like that he's like, he's obviously the outcast because he's little. Oh, oh fuck, dude. I right, probably just did you the favor. I like how he's the misfit and now he kind of is running the misfit army. Oh, shit. Ooh, they're going around finishing everyone off. Did we win? We wouldn't be having this conversation if we didn't. Oh, what, dude? Oh, they are this fucking ruthless. So what, what happened to Rob? The scouts were wrong. There were 2,000 Stark bannermen, not 20. Did we get the Stark boy at least? He wasn't here. Where was he? With his other 18,000 men. Did they make it to King's Landing? They do a diversion? Where the hell are we? What is this? We're in the fucking snow biome now. Oh, they got him. By the time they knew what was happening, it had already happened. Hell yes. Give me my daughters back. Give me my husband. <sighs> I've lost them too, I'm afraid. Kill him, Rob. Send his head to his father. Nope, we need him. We could end this war right now, boy. You fight for the Starks, I fight for the Lannisters. And let's end this here and now. No. You'd win. We're not doing it your way. Yeah, fuck that. I sent 2,000 men to their graves today. The bards will sing songs of their sacrifice. Aye. But the dead won't hear them. Yeah, I was just gonna say that. I was like, he basically just sent sacrifice 2,000. This war is far from over. Hell yeah, bro. They ain't even the end of season one yet. Robbie Boy stepping up. Can I have one? A lemon one. Or any of them. Three coppers. Do you have any stale ones from yesterday? Or any burnt ones? Piss off. Don't be rude, jackass. I'm trying to talk to you. Hey, where's everyone going? What's happening? They're taking him to the Scepter Baylor. Who? The Hand of the King. No, wait, what's the Scepter Baylor? It doesn't sound good. No, 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 dude. If he fucking dies, I'm actually gonna be pissed. We didn't even get to see him fucking, like, command the army or nothing. No, oh, man. These fucking goofballs have no idea what's going on. No, dude. You fucking morons, you have no idea. You guys are being used like pawns. Scumbag. Oh, is this because he has to be like, Joffrey, you're my king. Do what needs to be done, man. I betrayed the faith of my king and the trust of my friend Robert. I swore to protect and defend his children, but before his blood was cold, I plotted to murder his son and seize the throne for myself. Damn. You gotta swallow your fucking pride while saying that. Oh, you pussy bitch. 
What are you gonna do? Joffrey Baratheon is the one true heir to the Iron Throne. By the grace <laughs> of all the gods, Lord of the Seven Kingdoms, and protector of the realm. Yeah, he'll protect it, all right. With his goofy ass fucking face. My mother wishes me to let Lord Eddard join the Night's Watch. Stripped of all titles and powers, he would serve the realm in permanent exile. And my lady Sansa has begged mercy for her father. But I'm waiting for the soft hearts of women. Oh my god. So long as I am your king, treason shall never go unpunished. Is this fucking kid alright? Bring me his head. No, dude. No, 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 no. No, you fucking pussy bitch. You fucking pussy. Yeah, they have the heart of women, not someone like me. You fucking idiot. No. no. I'm gonna get fucking pissed, dude. Put, put, take that stupid do-rag off. I'm gonna get mad. Dude, I'm gonna get fucking pissed. Someone come in and save the day. Somebody. My heart's going. No, no. Fuck, no, dude, don't do this. No, someone save the day, please, please. Are you fucking kidding me, dude? What a fucking joke. Ha, <laughs> ah, they have, they have hearts of women, not me, because I'm King Joffrey. This is unbelievable, unbelievable. Wow, wow. What just happened to him is the furthest thing from okay. And the fact that we have fucking Joffrey calling the shots, running the show. And that's what does our boy in. Can't even imagine what's going to happen right now in this episode. Yep, nope, they did it. They fucking did it. Oh my god, are you kidding? Remember me now, boy. Hey. Remember me as a black boy. Yeah, you're the last thing I want to be looking at right now. Remember me, boy. And you'll be keeping your mouth shut. Oh my god, the dude, are you kidding? What'd they do to her? Oh, she faint? Wow. They really did that? I'm not a boy! You're not a smart boy, is that what you're trying to say? North, boy. We're going north. He plays two go chief. Ah! I had three eyes. He told me to come with him, so I did. We went down into the crypt. You're afraid, just like Hodor. I'm not afraid of some hole in the ground. You've lived beyond the wall. What are you scared of? I'm a cripple boy and I'm willing to go. All right, but you're stupid. Is she from Harry Potter too? She looks very familiar. I don't even know if the last guy was. He just he looked like the janitor guy. That's where I saw father. You see? He's not here. <laughs> the hell's Roman? Oh. Quick on! That beast is supposed to be chained in the kennels. Come back up with us. No, I came to see father. Who is this kid? I don't remember this kid at all. I didn't know they had another brother. What am I missing? You both miss him. That doesn't mean that. Brian. Dude, that's crazy. That's crazy. They basically neutered the whole main family within the first season. Has word got to her yet? Yeah, it must. Now it's officially war. They fucking beheaded Ned. <laughs> Rob. All right, dog, you're wasting the fucking steel on the blade doing this. You've ruined your sword. That's what I, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Shit, now what? Fucking idiot. I get it. Tensions are high. But do that with like a stick or something. I'll kill them all. I hope. I hope you got enough dog in you, Rob. We're gonna get Jon Snow back. And we're gonna bring the boys in the front line. And we're gonna fuck them up. We have to get the girls back. And then we will kill them all. Yes. We will. Robert lost his battle and he failed his final test. The lion ripped his balls off and the boar did all the rest. Come on, clap. That was pretty good. God, what's Joffrey gonna be like? That wasn't good enough. Very amusing. Isn't it a funny song? <laughs> Tell me, which do you favor? Your fingers or your tongue? If you got to keep one, which would it be? My tongue. Oh, I don't know. Ah, uh, yeah, probably my tongue. I could just cut your throat. All right, shut up. Every man. man needs hands, your grace. Good. Tongue it is. Your grace, please. Dude, are you kidding? And these guys, these, these, these morons, they got fucking not an ounce of honor in them. I'm done for the day. Oh, yeah, yeah. hard day at work, dude, clocking out. Your grace, please! Fucking idiots, idiots.
idiots. You look quite nice. Yeah, you don't. Keep my lord. Walk with me. I want to show you something. I can't fucking. <laughs> Oh my god. What is wrong with all these people? Like, you fucking pussies, all of you. And as soon as you've had your blood, I'll put a son in you. Mother says that shouldn't be long. You'll do no such thing. No, please, no! This one's your father. This one here. Are you kidding? I must to be merciful. I was. I gave him a clean death. Fucking bitch. Do you want to see the rest? If it please your grace. That's your scepter. There. I'll tell you. Huh. <laughs> Huh. After I raise my armies and kill your traitor brother, I'm going to give you his head as well. Gee. Or maybe he'll give me yours. Oh. What did you say to me? My mother tells me a king should never strike his lady, Samarin. Yeah, you do it for me. Oh, oh, the double papa. These people are the biggest fucking pussies I've ever seen in a show, period. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Girl. Will you obey now, or do you need another lesson? I think you need to push him right now. I'll look for you in court. Yeah, I'll see you there. Save yourself some pain, girl. Give him what he wants. You'll be needing that again. Oh, yeah, you're gonna be getting backhands all day. We gotta get him. Pledge fealty to King Renly and move south to join our forces with his. Renly is not the king. That doesn't make Renly king. He's Robert's youngest brother. A brand can't be Lord of Winterfell before me. Renly can't be king before Stannis. Here is what I say to these two kings. Oh. Renly Baratheon is nothing to me. Nor Stannis, neither. What do they know of the war? Or the wolf's wood? Even their gods are wrong. <laughs> <laughs> there sits the only king I mean to bend my knee to. Yeah, for real. Why the would we... The king of the north! Yeah! To the king of the north. The king in the north. Yes, sir. Am I your brother now and always? My sword is yours in victory and defeat from this day until my last day. The King of the North! The, the King of the North! Dude, hell yeah. I mean, seriously, why were we taking orders from anyone else in the first place? Fuck that. Should have been Ned. Should have been. I want to see him. Leave us. Lord Farquaad ain't doing shit. Ooh. Your bed must be lonely. Is that why you came? I'm not at my best, but I think I can be of service. Slip out of that gown and we'll see if I'm up to it. <laughs> oh, how do you like that, buddy? I will kill you tonight, sir. Now, just torture the fuck out of him. The dark is coming for all of us. Why cry about it? Because you are going to the deepest of the seven hells if the gods are just. What gods are those? The trees your husband prayed to? Where were the trees when his head was getting chopped off? That is true. Stop pulling his fingernails off one by one. My son, Bran, how did he come to fall from that tower? I pushed him out the window. At least he admitted it. Hoped the fall would kill him. Why? You should get some sleep. It's going to be a long walk. Yeah, you left the part where you're a fucking weirdo out. What does it say? Have we captured Rob Stark yet? Who is this dude again? What's our next move? Stop talking. Get back into bed. Jamie captured. His arm is scattered. It's a catastrophe. Perhaps we should sue for peace. All right, that's dramatic. No truces. We should march on them at once. First, we must return to cast. They hurt my son. Everyone's such a pussy when things go wrong. Like, how about you, you fucking adults, just don't fight? Like, and fucking take care of Joffrey. He's the problem. Fucking idiots. Yeah, let's just fight each other till nothing gets accomplished. Fucking don't start nothing. Fucking idiots, dude. I always thought you were a stunted fool. Perhaps I was wrong. Half wrong? He's clearly not a fool. It appears we can't stay here. No one will stay here. Sir Gregor will head out with 500 writers. The rest of us will regroup at Harrenhal. We'll go to King's Landing. Do what? Rule. You will serve as Hand of the King in my stead. Oh, shit. Why not my uncle? Why not anyone? Why me? You're my son. Yeah, buddy. Oh, one more thing. You will not take that whore to court. All right, that, that's, <laughs> that's a little rude, but... So we got him going undercover, more or less, being the little snake in the grass. Sir Jorah. Gently. Gently. I like this guy. My son. Where is he? I want him. Boy did not live. Oh, for real? They didn't show anything regarding that. What do the women say? They say the child was... Monstrous. Twisted. What does that mean, though? He was scaled like a lizard. Blind, with leather wings like the wings of a bat. 
When I touched him, the skin fell from his bone. Inside, he was full of grave worms. I warned you that only death can pay for life. You knew the price. Where is Gold Drogo? Show him to me. Come, I will take you to him. Wait, hold the fuck up. Yeah, you gotta like figure out what the hell's going on right now. Uh oh. No, dude. Drogo. Oh, he's done. Oh, not the chapped lips, son. When will he be as he was? Sun rises in the west, sets in the east. When the seas go dry, when the mountains blow in the wind, like leaves. What the fuck does that mean? Just, just speak normal. Talking weeks, months, years. I saved you. Saved me. Three of those riders had already before you saved me, girl. I saw my god's house burn. Tell me again exactly what it was that you saved. Your life. Yeah. Yeah, Why no. don't you take a look at your hal? Then you will see exactly what life is worth when all the rest has gone. I can't. Is he alive or no? I mean, he looks dead as shit. What are you going to do? I'm gonna find my brother. It's gonna be a long. Sword through King Joffrey's throat. Yes. Imagine he's the one to do it. Why are the stars on? Why does this fucking thing do this? Should I just leave it? No, I'll leave it. Move. No. Yes. I've yet to decide who I want it to be that takes Joffrey out. I think John would be a good one. Actually, no, probably Arya, because I feel like Arya has a stronger, like, reason to hate him because she witnessed more of him. Everyone, everywhere, always has to do exactly what my father says. He's always been a... <laughs> oh, shit. Why don't you come with me? Be the hands lady. Didn't you just say she can't, he can't bring her? I guess if she's promoted? <laughs> Yeah, nothing bad better happen to that dog. The oh no, Kip, bro. Yeah, that was Sam, right? Oh, I hope they join him. I hope they join him. I belong with my brother. But where are your brothers now? They'll kill you if they find out you've gone. They'll kill you if they know you came after me. You took the oath. You can't leave. I have to. You can't. You said the words. Night gathers, and now my watch begins. It shall not end until my death. I, I pledge my life. life. And honor to the night's watch for this night and all nights to come. Alright, that was cute. No one cares, dude. He's gonna go be with his brothers. His real brothers. Alright, what the hell are we all standing around for? Fucking either join me or not. Girl, he's gone. Done. <laughs> Dumb, stupid. I think it's over. Give him a. Smooch. Bring him back. <laughs> oh, that's gonna do it. Are you kidding me? Smooch from Kalishi is about to come back with fucking Super Saiyan strength. Dude, no chance. No chance. No. Girl, no. Ow! Oh, don't smother Cal Drago. Oh, look at him. He's like, ah. Uh, Stop, stop, I'm awake, I'm awake. That's some bullshit. Dude, all these badass characters are going in such, like, just pussy way. I mean, not pussy ways, like, but... In the past 67 years, I have known, truly known, more kings than any man alive. They're complicated men, but I know how to serve them. Keep on serving them. <coughs> all right, well, hey, relax. <laughs> what the fuck? I sense true greatness on the horizon for our new king. Oh, he's fucking lost it, this guy. Yeah, true greatness. Yep, King Joffrey for life. Does this dude even hear himself speak? What thing? About kings. Said the thing you need to understand about kings. Uh, what, uh, things? What? Uh... When you started, you... Yeah, he's fucking lost it. Get, get, get this dude out of fucking office. Dude can't even do fucking six times six and he's helping the king. What? <laughs> he's a nimble bastard, though. Look at him. Look at those legs. Ooh, ooh. Oh, what was squishing? God bless him. Punk bitch. You could tell he just has a slimy face. Ugh. Must be strange for you, even after all these years. A man from another land, despised by most, feared by all. Am I? That is good to know. Do you lie awake at night fearing my gash? But you carry on, whispering in one king's ear, and then the next. I admire you. And I admire you, Lord Baelish. A grasper from a minor house with a major talent for befriending powerful men. And women. A useful talent, I'm sure you'd agree. They always have the sickest roast battles in here. They always sit there and like, 
<laughs> throw digs at each other. This lot, half of them would turn you over to the king quick as spit for a part, and the other half would do the same, except they'd rape you first. So oh. keep to yourself, and when you piss, do it in the woods alone. Stay, or I'll lock you in the back of the wagon with these three. Ah, oh, shit. Watch yourself, midget. Hey, fucking, that one's so rude. What's a gutter rat like you doing with a sword? Maybe he's a little squire. I'll bet he stole that sword. Let's have a look. Oh, fuck off, dude. Yeah, before I fucking po- Oh, my God. I could use me a sword like that. Yeah, I bet you could. You'd use that as a toothpick. You better give up by the sword. I've seen him kick a boy to death. I knocked him down, and I kept kicking him until he was dead. I kicked him all to pieces. God, they are disgusting. You better give me that sword! You want it? I'll give it to you. I'll give it to you in the fucking neck. Kill one fat boy. I bet you never killed anyone. I bet you're a liar. But I'm not. I'm good at killing fat boys. I like killing fat boys. Yeah, I got the extra meat. Oh, you like picking on the little ones, do you? Yeah, I've been hammering an anvil these past ten years. When I hit that steel, it sings. You gonna sing when I hit you? You gonna sing, fat boy? Nah, yeah, they're, yeah, they're all talk, dude. Poor Arya. Dude, no. She's she's going to the wall as John's leaving, or is he still here? Hopefully. How many days in a row, Mr. Bambi? Expected to start his day with ham. Okay, good. In a way. Do you think your brother's war is more important than ours? Probably not. Dead men and worse come hunting for us in the night. Do you think it matters who sits on the Iron Throne? No. Good, because I want you and your wolf with us when we ride out beyond the wall tomorrow. Oh shit, where are we going, son? Beyond the wall. I'll not sit meekly by and wait for the snows. Taking the battle. The Night's Watch will ride in force against the wildlings, the white walkers, and whatever else is out there. Oh shit. So I'll only ask you once, Lord Snow. Are you a brother of the Night's Watch or a bastard boy? <laughs> Who wants to play at war? Yeah, dude, you want to play at war, you play it against the White Walkers. Shit, we're taking the fight to them, huh? Done fucking waiting around all day? We lost Cal Drago to bullshit. We lost Ned to bullshit. What are we doing? Drogo will have no use for dragon eggs in the nightlands. Sell them. Return to the free cities and live as a wealthy woman for all your days. They were not given to me to sell. Okay, man. Just leave them in the dark. Khaleesi, I know what you intend. Do not. I must. Must why? Don't ask me to stand aside as you climb on that pyre. I won't watch you burn. Is that what you fear? Oh. Oh shit, yeah, my man's back on board now. He's like, okay, okay. So you're a bind this woman to the pyre. Oh yeah, you're done, lady. We don't fuck with that witchcraft shit around here. I am the dragon's daughter, and I swear to you that those who would harm you will die screaming. You will not hear me scream. I will. What kind of fucking... You, you won't hear me scream. All right, tell me that was you burning alive. All right, she's gone cold. How'd they get all the gasoline to do that? Hey, oh, hey, oh, hey. Yeah, that definitely doesn't feel good, so God bless her. You won't hear me scream. Okay, lady. Where'd your clothes go? How is she okay? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, no fucking way. Oh, boy. She's gonna be unstoppable. And she's got this going without a shirt on. What the fuck? Thing is, how fast do they grow up? I'm still pissed we lost it, Ed. But that's pretty cool. You guys voted for this one over on Patreon. So if you want to get the full length reactions to Game of Thrones dropping every week, you can find that over on Patreon, along with getting the YouTube videos early and all the exclusives and all that. All right, if you guys want more of the YouTube edits for Game of Thrones, be sure to hit that like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments. So I just finished Game of Thrones season one, and it was definitely something, to say the least. But the death of Ned Stark is just something I feel it was so unnecessary. But I guess it did its job because it was effective. But at the same token, the death of him and Robert, I think is just so 
so abrupt. But then I, I, I see people in the fucking comments being like, Mike, that's so... You just know you can't get attached to any character. And I was like, okay, I get that. And I kind of like that to an extent. Like, I don't want anyone to feel safe. I like that in shows when they have actual consequences. But in the case of that, I think there's a difference between establishing that and then, like, just fucking killing them off so abruptly. But I guess... It is kind of realistic, like, if they're set in that kind of time period, like, you just go out, you never know, your days are numbered, you could die from fucking anything back in that time, but to have Robert die an off-screen death, or I guess the incident be off-screen where a boar got him and shit and he just comes back, it just all felt just so, so quick, too quick, and the death of Ned... I at least wanted half of another season with him. We didn't get to see him in combat. We didn't get to see him and Johnny Boy get back together. There's so many things I would have fucking loved to see. I guess he was in Lord of the Rings too. I haven't seen Lord of the Rings in a fat minute. But John's obviously a solid character. The whole arc of protecting the wall and his new buddy Sam. And it's... It's a well-written show, obviously. I'm all on board. Joffrey, they do an amazing job at making you fucking hate Joffrey. But the death of Ned. That's all I think of. That's all I've been thinking about since I wrapped up season one. It's just like that's the that's the thing that just sticks with me already. Yeah, they're sprinkling the seeds of the White Walkers. But it was interesting because when they established them in the first scene of the entire show and he comes out. And uh, it gave me Predator vibes when he cuts the dude's head off. And uh, and then when John is, uh, some dude's revving his bike. When John saves, I, I, I just can't think of the names right now. John saves the other dude from the zombie and he was way more zombie-like. So I assume there's gonna be varying degrees to the White Walkers, which is interesting. The world building and the set pieces unmatched unfucking matched. I don't think I've ever seen any show even come close to competing with that. Definitely not. J the shot of, uh, I can't think of the name. Well, King's Landing. King's Landing is fucking sick, but th the specific one where it's like on really tall ass rocks and it's where the, pre the breastfeeding kid and um, Lady Stark's sister are living at. That place looks sick when they throw Tyrion in the goddamn prison that's like overlooking the cliff. That location I think is my favorite looking so far of the entire show. Oh, and the death of Cal Drago. That, it, it, they all just feel so fucking abrupt. And like for Cal Drago, really like, he, he got a little cut and got infected. I guess yet again, shit like that would happen. But to take out those three characters in that kind of fashion, all within the first season, is fucking insane. Like we didn't even get to really see Cal Drago the Warlord even really go into battle and fuck some shit up when he does kill Daenerys' brother is definitely a top moment though that's crazy pouring the molten gold on his face i, I had a feeling he I, what's i can't remember his name just Daenerys' brother i kind of had a feeling he wasn't going to stick around long but i actually would have liked him to stick around longer because he's he was just such a fucking dweeb he was a piece of dog shit though selling your sister off to Khal Drago. she ended up fucking with him though which is crazy she ended up liking it the horses are really such a bizarre animal. Me and Roman went kayaking 